What's up guys, the Brandon is 98 here and today we're going to be having another tutorial on the PS3 to get another game for free. The last one got a lot of views and I really do appreciate that. And some people got it to work, some people didn't, some people didn't get it in the right time. It just it just depends. It, it doesn't always work, some people does. So I guess you can just try and see if it works or not. So, But let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to show you how to do it completely. So you want to create a new user and you can name it whatever you want. Uh... Let's just do pre order, then hit OK. And then you want to go into that account. It's going to sign off your last one, of course. And then once you signed off to your last one, it's going to put you into the new account. And you want to go to sign up. And you want to go to create new account and continue and you not you don't you don't you want to make sure your region just set doesn't it's not your real country or unless you live in the country I'm about to put um, you probably don't understand what I'm saying if you do but you want to put Qatar and then English or whatever language you speak put whatever date you want I'm just gonna do 94 cuz I really don't care I'm just trying to get through this fast here then this is the worst part of it all um, really you have to agree to the terms of service basically what you're doing is creating a new account but in the region Qatar so the Qatar part is the most one of the most important parts to this glitch and uh, some people will say that it won't work or whatever um, they tried it on the watchdogs one and it didn't work the reason why is because you do have to uh, take auto download off um, that way you can be able to keep the game some people said that it still worked other way and so it just depends because there was a lot some people said it didn't work some people said yes it worked so it just I I really don't know what's the difference between why some people didn't and some people did I couldn't tell you to be honest uh, you guys can talk to each other in the comments um, try to figure that out yourselves because I I'm trying to figure it out myself and I have no idea but today we're going to be pre-ordering the the new what do you would call it game uh, Battlefield Hardline um, a lot of people is gonna is pretty hype about the beta and stuff, so we're gonna have and do that, and we might go ahead and do it for what do you call that? Advanced Warfare, the new one coming out, Call of Duty. I think people would want to watch that, or Destiny. Well, if Destiny is on there, we might do Destiny instead because I that, that game is supposed to be pretty hyped up. Um, so yeah, we'll just go hurry up and get through this terms and service, which is the most annoying thing ever. I really, I really do have to agree. I mean, it's kind of smart for Sony, if you think about it. Um, and then once you know what the terms of service, make an an email. I'm just gonna put I D G A F one two three four at g mail dot net <laughs> it'll work even if it's not a real thing and it said that just hit okay um, and then you have to put a password and then just just do fake Sorry, I'm kind of concentrating on typing this right. The last one I failed like four times. And hopefully I didn't screw up. Oh, heh, I didn't. Um, account name, do whatever you want, to be honest. Uh, I'm just going to do... Let's see. Texas underscore hacker... Just because I want to do this. Seven, over here. One, one, five. There we go. Okay. And then first name, you can do what you want. Just put in GH, HG, 
gender, male. This stuff really doesn't matter. Um, you just want to get past this part to as fast as possible. Fast as possible, to be honest. Uh, it doesn't really matter. You can put whatever you want. Um, profit. This stuff really doesn't matter. Like I said, um, you should be able to get past it. No problem, to be honest. And see, I just put a bunch of random crap. And you don't want to click any of those because I don't want any of them. And you want to go all the way to the bottom and hit confirm. I know it's a little bit of a tedious thing to have to create a whole new account just to, but you are getting a pretty expensive game to do it. And now nah, I'll do that later. And then go to PlayStation Store, sign in. Let's do automatic sign in. And let's go ahead and sign up into this account. And we're in. And so now you're going to be put into the PlayStation Store. And it's going to look a little bit different um, because you're in the car store, not in the American store. So it's going to we'll look a little bit different for you guys. Hopefully this thing loads not too slowly. There we go. Starting to load here. And and we're supposed to be in here, but there we go. Now PlayStation Store is here for us. Well, it just yeah. See, um, it looks a little bit different, but there's ghosts and this kind of stuff here. But you, what you want to do is go to you see. Here's Destiny. So let's let's go ahead and get Destiny since it's right here. And since it's not out yet, you hit pre-order. And once you hit pre-order, you're gonna you're gonna wanna click um, proceed to checkout. You're gonna hit add funds, and you wanna hit code, and hit cancel, and then you wanna confirm purchase. And it's going to say activating. Please wait. Let it load. And there we go. And then you're going to hit OK. And then it's going to say, please wait a few times. And then, boom, there's your game. So you want to do download all. and let's go ahead and get through this and you get the theme and everything for free too so that's pretty awesome guys although you do get the theme if you can get the theme for free either way if you go ahead and watch one of my previous videos on how to get free themes for the PS3 that are way better than the ones that are on the PlayStation Store anyways though you should watch that if you haven't seen it and let's go ahead and keep this thing loading Sorry about this loading thing, guys. To be honest, this is my first time recording this Destiny pre-order glitch because I really don't want to make too many users on my PS3. I already have that problem <laughs> having too many users on there, but that is fine. Um, shouldn't be too too much of a hassle since, according to you, did just get a what what how how much did you say that was like seventy dollar game for free? And you want to uh, let's see, I just got the theme see here's the bundle pack I guess auto download right here when you wanna you wanna turn the da auto download off download to the system automatically you wanna hit OK because you don't want it downloaded to your system automatically and so now what you want whenever it comes out you wanna make sure you wanna you wanna make sure the day before start downloading it that way you'll get it on the actual you'll get it on the right time but that's one thing you want to do make sure it is not on auto download so make sure that's not on auto download and I just did the second one is not on auto download and you gotta make sure they're all turned off click the little check mark and hit OK and then you'll go to please wait and then once you've got the please wait it's all the auto downloads are off so therefore you have all the game you have all of them pre-ordered 
and you're done this now we can go to our download list and view downloads and right there boom we even have the destiny theme that is crazy guys we what, you just got a seventy dollar game that's supposed to be really good absolutely free so that's gonna be about it for today guys like comment subscribe and um if you enjoyed make sure to share this because the last one got a lot of shares so i do appreciate that and like i said i'll probably be doing another one of these for like battlefield hardline um but that's about it for today like comment subscribe and always always my friends stay butter